Hey Holt High School, it's Mr. Case coming to you from the North Campus. Today is October 22nd, Friday, third best day of the week. Competitive cheer. Athletes interested in competitive cheer should register to receive the pre-tryout meeting information. Scan the QR code on the flyers hanging up around the school or visit Coach Gibbs or Coach Henderson in the Lower East Hall. Practices begin November 8th. Make sure you're ready. No prior experience is needed. We will train you on tumbling and stunting skills. We are looking for hardworking athletes who want to learn and have fun. Science Olympiad. We will be starting our Science Olympiad season soon with our first meeting Thursday, November 4th in room West 209 at the high school main campus, 2.45 to 3.45 p.m. Interested students can also join our Google Classroom to read about the events and get started. The join code is RN7JQ4W. Holt Early College, attention 10th grade students. The Holt Early College application window is now open. There was an email from Mr. Schrauben that went home on October 5th that includes information about our early college program. Please review that email. If you'd like to apply, pick up a paper application in the counseling office at the main campus or use the digital copy that's in the email from Mr. Schrauben. Applications are due November 10th with a mandatory parent meeting on November 11th. Students at Drive. Driving to school is a privilege and a big responsibility. We've had multiple instances of students driving unsafely before and after school on and off school property. For the sake of your safety and those in your car and everyone around you, focus on your driving without distractions and be safer by slowing down. Always be cautious and courteous of others. Testing next week. On Tuesday, students that have already registered will take the PSAT 9 at the North Campus and the PSAT NMSQT at the Main Campus. On Thursday, seniors that have already registered will take the SAT at the North Campus. Instruction for those days have been sent out to the students and the parents. Several South Hall classrooms will be used on Tuesday at the main campus, so we need all students to be very quiet during passing time, especially in that area. Bells will be turned off during testing. Teachers will dismiss their students according to the normal bell schedule. Seniors, Herf Jones will be at the North Campus Tuesday and Wednesday next week during lunch periods to take your cap and gown orders. They will have class of 22 apparel, tassels, and other items with them for you to buy too. Seniors that need a packet can get one from the North Campus office. See the announcements. Uh, There's a a link in the email so you can order stuff. MSU versus Michigan. Saturday, October 30th, Michigan State football hosts Michigan. So, next Friday, October 29th, please wear the colors of the team you're going to be rooting for. Will you wear green and white or maize and blue? Student of the Week, Freshman Alasia Moore, nominated by Miss Henderson. Miss Henderson said, Alasia shows up every day at 100%. She is always making sure her friends are taken care of academically and emotionally and is always ready to help others in Spanish class. She works hard to make sure school is a safe and welcoming place for all. Congratulations, Alasia. Joy Williams, nominated by Miss Gretchen Gibbs. Ms. Gibbs said, Joy is just an all-around amazing human. She participates in class, she goes out of her way to help others, and always does whatever she can to brighten people's day. I appreciate Joy so much. Ms. Gibbs, I appreciate Joy too. Congratulations, Joy. Junior Kennedy Graham Walker, nominated by Mrs. Silvestro and Ms. Abdullah. Ms. Silvestro said, Kennedy is always willing to say hi and share how she is doing with me when I come upon her throughout the building. She is true to her friends and isn't afraid to self-advocate. Ms. Abdullah said, I am proud of how Kennedy has stepped up as a link. She is making a difference for students every day. Congratulations, Kennedy. Senior Lucas Arend, nominated by Mrs. Lind. Mrs. Lynn said, Lucas demonstrates a true caring for his classmates, excellent leadership skills, and is working very hard on ensuring that his volunteer project, Whole High School's Greenhouse, is a successful venture. Congratulations, Lucas. Our staff members of the week start off with Mr. Jason Smith, an English teacher, nominated by an anonymous student. 
The student said he is an amazing teacher and makes class fun to the point where I always look forward to having his class. Congratulations, Mr. Smith. Mrs. Jackie Perry, security, nominated by an anonymous student. The student said that she's a very kind and caring person and takes the time to get to know the kids and understand us kids. I agree completely, anonymous student. Congratulations, Mrs. Perry. Mr. Dave Hildebrandt, math, nominated by Haley McGrath and an anonymous student. Haley said, upperclassmen saying you're an awesome teacher is one thing, but when some of my other teachers are saying how amazing you are and that they want to be a teacher like you, you have got to be one amazing teacher and valued staff member of Holt High School. The anonymous student said he always makes sure all of the students are doing okay. He is even willing to put in the extra work to challenge students who need it. He does his best to teach everything in a way that allows everyone to understand it. Congratulations, Mr. Hildebrandt. We appreciate you. Staff Members of the Week, please take time to nominate a Staff Member of the Week. Use the link to the Google form found in this email. We have only eight staff members left in our nomination form that haven't been showcased yet. Show some school appropriate love and nominate your favorite staff member. All right, that's the end of the announcements. I hope everyone has a great weekend.